The marshmallow sofa was designed by George Nelson and manufactured by Herman Miller. A staple of pop art, the sofa is a symmetrical design of circular cushions, comparable to a folded waffle. The marshmallow sofa is made of 18 cushions that were arranged on a steel frame after an inventor approached designers with an injection plastic disc that he claimed would be inexpensive and durable. This advancement meant that the couch would be easy to clean and resilient to wear. The disc eventually proved to be impractical, however. The 1956 marshmallow sofa is considered one of the greats of the pop art era in design in the arts. The sofa encouraged the use of bright colors, unconventional style, and strong shapes. It was a rebellious era of design focused on signage. Media content, campaigns, and advertising were the channels for pop art to flourish. As a part of the pop art movement, the sofa was associated with a lot of these propaganda. The marshmallow sofa was released post-war, and so it was included in the large public voice that followed. The sofa was a reflection of what the public wanted to change. It represented the actual popular opinion of culture in comparison to the high class, aristocracy, and ease. Bright colors and shapes showed the humanity of the 1960s revolution, void of the starchy upper class stigma. Pop art was brought into household product design with the marshmallow sofa. Very unlike traditional furniture, the marshmallow was a three-dimensional sofa. The symmetry and unique construction of the cushions, supported by a steel back, allowed the sofa to come in a variety of sizes and colors. The marshmallow sofa provided the means to personalize interiors and was intended for lobbies, homes, and offices. Holding many colors in a unique shape, the sofa coupled well in an eclectic scenario. The radical style, however, found difficulty aesthetically fitting in with current products that use more traditional visual mediums. Contextually, the sofa was ironically popular with elite pop art designers due to its impracticality in interiors. The sofa was intrinsically woven in an era of expression. It was a representation of surprise in human nature and bravery in design. While the marshmallow sofa ended up being impractical, it succeeded in making a strong statement. That is what George Nelson gave America. The sofa gave pop art, as well as the freedom of speech, criticism, and observation, a push after being suppressed by war. The marshmallow sofa touched many facets of American expression and means an remains an icon of our history. Created using Powtoon.